Curiosity Kid back, and today we are going to be putting together the TiVo Tarantula 3D printer. So let's get started. I bought this a few a week ago and it came today. So yeah. I'm gonna speed up the building process, but um yeah. So it's a kit you put together First time seeing it. And voila. Nice instructions. Nice bag. Packaged very nicely. Some white filament. This is this is white PLA. Um, 0.2 kilograms. This is pink PLA. They gave me two rolls of PLA. Okay, so this Oh, that's nice. They put the uh, uh, connectors so you can screw on and Heated bed, the extruder tube, cable, the heated bed, very nice, got a nice piece of foil on the bottom to keep the heat in. So, I'm just going to speed this up, and yeah.
my time lapse stopped, so yeah. So I'm working on I was working on this. It's the I don't know exactly which part this is. But I got the bed done. I got the frame all done. And now I'm working on this. So, check back. Well, I got this put together. I've got this part put. on this I still got to put the electronic board on here do this right right there but yeah so this is what I've done so far I've got that this still got a little ways to go I put the drive belt on the bed and yeah so I'll check back Well, I got it working. I had a couple of the wires mixed up. I had the uh, Z and Y. This is, I'm pretty sure this is the Y and yeah, well, anyway. But I had one of the, two of the axes messed up. But I did flip them, like I flipped the the motor, I put them in the right spot, but the end stops, I didn't flip, they were in the wrong spots too. So it was trying to always print over here, it started printing here, <clears throat> but I, yeah, but I finally got it to print, I printed a spool holder. <clears throat> and I, this was my first print, a Nerf Vortex disc. See, it kind of did the bridging well. I need to add <clears throat> these fans onto the head cooling fan. But yeah, so it printed okay. It was having a hard time um, hearing to the bed, but once it got started, it did okay. I mean, for my second print ever on a 3D printer, it's not bad, bad but I didn't design this. It was a uh, electro noobs. It kind of did that too. It's a little bit off. Because this bed wobbles, I need to fix that. I need to print a bracket for this. Just a few little things. But it's printing. If you don't put things backwards like I did, then you'll be doing pretty good. Did this pretty good. I have to downsize this to 80% to get it to fit. In the bed, I mean, I had a little bit of room, but it'll still hold a spool. Well, I'll put this. There. I use the tripod handle for the spool holder for now, but yeah, so, I can't remember what percentage of infill I used, but, yeah. So, bulgy on the bottom, but, yeah, it's 
So and then if you have some sandpaper, which I do, we can clean it up pretty nice. And some like a knife and some pliers like this. That's not good, but it comes up pretty. I don't know if you can see that, but it's pretty. I did this at 0 0.2 layer height because I wanted it to go a little bit faster. And yeah, but so yeah, and then that is going to go like this. It's going to screw on there. There or like this. Yeah, it seems pretty sturdy. And the bottom and I got messed up because this was really thin and with it not adhering to the bed. But yeah, I did have the heated bed on to 60 degrees. The nozzle was at 90. But yeah. I'm using PLA pink. Tebow only sent me a PLA and an ABS. Or, yeah, so gear best did that. But I may be mistaken. I thought I got one of each, like ABS and a <sighs> PLA. But I'm fine either way. So, uh, thanks for watching. I'll keep doing updates on like the um, cooling brackets, all that. This is gonna work good. So, thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. And it's a great printer for the price. You pros pretty easy to set up. It's got lots of support. Like lots of people have this printer, so there's lots of videos on YouTube. Um Comes with two rolls of filament, nice board, comes with an SD card, um, cons, it could have a cooling fan here, anything else, like, and a spool holder and a bracket, a stronger bracket. The bed's pretty big. The bed wobbles. It would be nice if that was on two. But, I mean, I think I can tighten it up with the eccentric nuts. Let's see here. I've been trying. Con, another con is the open, I don't know if you can see it, but the open power supply. But they did put connectors on these here. That's to go to 110. But yeah. Hope you liked it. Comment if you've got any comments. Like it, subscribe. So, thanks for watching.